Is this convenient or what, guys? Look, I got my chips, my drink, and my dip. So all it takes is one hand to hold, and the other one is for me to grab some chips, dip them in, my cheese dip, and then eat them. <laughs> What's up, pranksters? Welcome back. Yeah, I know, I've been gone for a few weeks, guys. It's just that I caught this really bad case of World Cup fever. I've been keeping up with the World Cup, and it's kept me away from making videos, at least on my main channel. But now I'm back, guys, and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys some really cool hacks, snack hacks, for the World Cup. So if you guys love snacks, you're gonna love these snack hacks. Now, before we begin, guys, let's make sure you guys are subscribed to this channel with the bell notifications turned on. That way you guys know when I upload my next video. Let's get started. Check it out. All right, pranksters, I got a bunch of snacks here that I'm gonna show you guys some really cool hacks for. Ooh, a bag of Hot Cheetos Extra. Let me show you an awesome hack that you guys can do with this bag. All right, so this bag of Hot Cheetos Extra is not just for one person. Of course, it's big enough so that you guys can share with your friends and family during the game. Now, a good way to share it with your friends and family is the following. You're gonna open up the bag like normal, just like this. And look, look at the inside, it's filled with hot Cheetos. Now, a good way to keep this bag standing is for you guys to do the following. Because if you let it go, look what happens. It tilts forward or back. And we don't want that, right? For this life hack, we're gonna need two forks, two plastic disposable forks. So, let's do this first, guys. Let's roll down the bag, like so. Roll it all the way down as much as you can so most of the hot Cheetos are exposed. All right, that works. So it should look something like this at this point, guys. You're gonna take one fork and stick it inside the roll, like so, and do the same to the other side. And look, guys, the forks will keep the bag standing up so now everybody can just grab some hot Cheetos and you don't have to pass around the bag. It can be centered on the table and anybody can just reach over and grab some. This is a very simple chip life hack. It's very convenient, especially if you guys don't have any bowls at the house. As you guys can see right here, I have a bunch of snacks. Now, I don't like keeping my snacks on top of the table. This is a really beat up coffee table, but I don't like keeping it messy. I don't like having my snacks on the table. So a good way to be organized, guys, is the following. Get yourself a cereal box like this one all you need is the box, so if it has cereal inside, take it out. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get rid of the cereal, because all we need is the box. Now let me show you where I'm gonna put this box. This right here is my coffee table, and look guys, all I gotta do is take my box and place it on the edge right here. So I'll just tape it down to the side of the coffee table. A Little bit of tape. That's pretty much it, pranksters. So look now, I can simply just fill up the box with my snacks. For example, my M&Ms can go in there. My Twinkies fit in there perfectly. Bean dip, I'll need that for my chips later. A little bag of chips. And pretty much anything else you guys can fit in there. And look at that, I'll have the snacks off the table. And when I get hungry, all I gotta do is reach down there where my cereal box is at, and grab a bag of chips. My M&Ms are right there. And other bunch of snacks that I put in there. So it's very, very convenient. It's a great way to stay organized during the big games. Here's a great way for you guys to share some cookies. If you have a couple family members with you watching the game and you have a pack of cookies like this one, well, all you guys gotta do is open up the bag, actually open up the whole thing and take out the whole pack of cookies. Just like this. See guys, instead of passing around this pack of cookies, what you guys can do is take a pair of scissors and divide it into three sections. Since basically it's already divided for you, all you guys gotta do is cut it. So take some scissors and careful when doing this, but cut. 
the pack in three. Just like that, guys. Look, you give this to one of your friends, and then you cut the other one. You give this to your other friend, or your cousin or little brother, and this is yours. It's divided evenly, guys, and that way you guys don't have to argue who got more than who. It's divided evenly, just like that. I really, really, really love this following life hack, guys. I've used it and it really works. Especially if you guys are at a get-together watching the big game and there aren't any seats or tables for you. Here's what you guys do. You grab yourself a soda can, a bag of chips, some dip, and a straw. Here's what you guys do. You're gonna take the bag of chips and you're gonna tape it on to the soda can. So, with some clear tape, that's what I'm gonna do. On both sides, all right, guys? So on one side it's gonna have tape and on the other side it's gonna have more tape. Alright. Then we're gonna take our soda guys and we're gonna open it. Alright and then you're gonna take the tab and make sure it's standing up like this. Should look something like this guys. Standing up, you're gonna take your dip, open it. I'm just gonna open mine halfway. And this is cheese dip. And you're gonna tape it onto the tab, just like this. And also do the same to the back so it does not fall off. All right, that is perfect. Now let's open up the chips. How awesome is that? And of course you guys are asking yourselves, how are you gonna drink? Well, get your straw, just put it through the opening. And that's it guys. Is this convenient or what guys? Look, I got my chips, my drink, and my dip. So all it takes is one hand to hold and the other one is for me to grab some chips, dip them in, my cheese dip, and then eat them. Very convenient. This is perfect if there's no tables around, as I said. If there's no tables, nowhere to sit, this hack will come in handy. And look, I have my straw ready here to wash down the chips with my soda. For this next life hack, guys, we're gonna be using the same cereal box we used earlier. We are just gonna put it together. So, make sure you guys fold all the flaps and tape it down. Because with this, we'll be creating a little food tray for when you guys are at a party and there are no tables available you have nowhere to sit and you have to hold all your food at the same time so here's what you guys are gonna do for example if they have plates like bowls of chips you're gonna measure them out so place the bowl on top of the cereal box and make an outline it's not so hard guys just draw a circle around the bowl that you're gonna be cutting just as long as it gives you enough space to put the bowl in so something like that and then I'm also gonna make room for my dip, which happens to be beans this time. So I'm also gonna make a cut for it. And I can't be having chips without a drink, right? So I'll also do the same with this soda can. Again, it doesn't have to be perfect. All right, let's begin the cutting process. And I'm just going to use my trusty blade for this. Alright, there's one opening. So I'll do the same to the other outlines that I made. Okay, so we got three cutouts right there. This is where my chips are going to go, my dip, and my soda. So I'm just going to add some chips to my bowl. Alright, I'm going to place my bowl where it goes. I'm gonna open up my can of beans. Look at that. Put it where it goes. And I have my Sprite right here. Yeah, I don't have any Pepsi right now, guys. They're all gone, so I'm gonna be using Sprite for this example. And look, it goes right there. And I can hold this tray while watching the big game. And if you have a larger cereal box, even better, you guys can fit in more things. Look, all it takes is one hand to hold my tray so I could be grabbing some chips, dipping them into my bean dip, and eating it. 
without struggling. We all go through that problem where we're at a party and there's no tables because there's a lot of people there, right? So we gotta eat standing up. This is a very handy hack for those that go through that issue. And look, I even have my soda ready. I drink it, put it back, and now I'm ready to eat some more chips. It's that simple, guys. These are very easy hacks that you guys can do at home for the big game. Not much goes into them, right? So try them out, they will definitely come in handy. Now if you guys are keeping up with the World Cup, I am as well on my Cinex TV channel. So if you guys want some fidget spinner predictions, check those out. Links are in the description, in the cards as well. Remember that I'll be uploading more pranks and hacks on this channel. So subscribe if you haven't yet. Guys, hit those bell notifications so you guys are alerted of when I upload my next video. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I'll see you pranksters in my next video. All right, pranksters, if you guys wanna see more life hacks like the ones I just showed you, click up here. Now, if you guys are interested in pranks, click up here. Go ahead, guys, click on either one of them. I'm waiting.